everybody, now we're in Paris we have some exciting stuff to do. The first thing we want to do is take a look down here. There are bots everywhere, there are guards everywhere, and we have a sniper rifle. So let's clear up the streets before we have to go down there. Because it's no fun, well, no. It can be fun trying to, uh, you know, evade the guards, coming down to a hostile street. Um, but I like to clear it out before I get there. And this, <laughs> this is why I took the spy drone. Yes, yes, I could be using a gap gun. Yes, yes, I could try using a lamb. But I've lost the bot. What the actual hell? All right. All right, you guys win. So yes, I am going to take a little bit of time here just to clear everyone out. I can understand that might be a little bit boring, so feel free to skip ahead. I don't need you don't need me to tell you to skip ahead if you find this boring. And I know that you may not know exactly what you're looking at, but it is a cool idea to take a couple of moments while up here just to ex uh, kind of plan out where you're going to explore, seeing the sneaky little alleyways. Um, and if you want, you can I exploit Super Jump to get to the bottom. Cool story, Jump. Okay, there are some greasels around. I am interested. Uh, that's bad. <laughs> I am interested in killing these greasels now. It would be really, really awesome if I could kill them now. But I'm uncertain of if I'm in the correct area. There is a, a side quest to kill some greasels that have been killing a poor lady's cats. And I do think you get experience for it. Uh, just because I need four picks doesn't mean that my picks are bound to key number four. So I'm not sure how far through this mission I'm going to go in this video. Um, silhouette in the Paris Catacombs. Yeah, that seems like it's going to be a an entire video worth of stuff. Oh. Dude. Dude. What the hell? Let me out. Yeah, thanks, Tong. What's the other way I'm supposed to go? Ah, 
See, I wasted my time. I'm sorry. Um, but I'm sure that the lady is around here somewhere. There she is. What's wrong? Somebody should kill those. So the quest is the four greasels in the sewer. Oh, I can totally do that. Ah, uh, <laughs> the batteries in my mouse are dying. So we do have to find a way through this. Now this might be our first, uh, our first experience with Greasels, depending on the exploration that we've done. There, that should be all the Greasels. She said four, right? Yeah, okay. So I'm going to take a very brief detour back. Two hundred skill points. There we go. Okay, so I, I think I'm going to save up for computer. Okay, now this is where it gets dangerous. You know, I remember there being more, uh, more patrolling guards every time I played. But... I'm not complaining. Okay, the catacombs are an extremely confusing place. I'm very sorry if I get lost, I have never been able to navigate them. I 
recommend that you explore on your own, but there will be a couple of difficult uh, rooms which may not be the easiest to take out by yourself. That's not what it's like. Those service Body shots, huh? running seriously low on ammunition for the uh, sniper rifle. I have been going crazy with it. That's a nice texture. That's really nice. Uh, you know what? I don't know how people do melee runs. How do you play this game with a melee weapon? Now I've gone the other direction. This is going to be confusing for people. Any minute we're going to come face to face with that guy. And I don't want to be unsaved before I do that. The downside to not getting lost this time <laughs> is that I haven't cleared out all the enemies that perhaps I should. Okay, thank you Tong. just run in a big circle, so <laughs> don't be lost. Despite the catacombs being giant big rock halls where every little movement would echo, uh, this is probably the easiest looking place to stealth. Ah, okay. Ah, oh, this is where we are. Take a look at my health. Yeah. Hmm. I put a point into medicine. I think I'm going to put another point into low, te <laughs> low tech, even though I'm having no luck with it. And then, if I get enough points, I'll finish off on computer. But I don't think that's very important. 
Okay, so... Even though I disabled that, that's for my cunning... my cunning next move. Is absolutely brutal. So there are a couple ways um, around that. You can put this barrel a little bit away from the edge and jump onto it and then jump across. And then of course we can get in there. But what does that have? A repair bot. And I'm not so desperate for repairs. Especially when I can duplicate my bioelectricity cells. What I am interested in is trying to do this with minimal dying. Thanks, Tong. <laughs> Hilarious. That is balls how man how there we go all right fucking a Oh, good, he has like a healing shield. <laughs> okay. Um. Alright, there's, there's an easy way of doing this, and there's a hard way of doing this. And I'm doing it the hard way. No, no, I was doing it the the average way. That um, turn on this orc. All right. I'll take that. I will happily accept that. Fucking cameras. That's not fair. And I'm not going to live there either. If I'm not mistaken, there is a lady in black. And now we play chicken with this guy. <laughs> there we go, ladies and gentlemen, that's how you do it. That's the part that I say is a bit tricky. Maybe you can see why I think that. I do want to hold on to as much sniper ammo as I can because there is a beautiful stealthy snipey mission coming up and I love it and I definitely want to have my sniper ready for it I turned on my Aqualung. But what's the point? Okay, 
Okay, so that is the stealthy way in, ladies and gentlemen. There's a little bit of water right here that you can just dive in, jump out the other end, grab the key, We'll let them run free, and I have just enough skill points to go cray cray with my melee. Okay, that doesn't work. You can only expect so much. 50%! Ladies and gentlemen, I think I've wasted my skill points. We have to get That's what you get? I mean, I thought this was unspoken and understood between us, but you're free to put your skill points wherever you want. I thought, I, I might have made that clear in the first video. Uh, so if you've been following my skill point allocation this whole time <laughs> and you're really really pissed off that I've put it into melee um sorry oh my god 10 years later I just want to make sure that she gets here safe so tempting. Now there is a very brief detour that you can take. Uh, I don't remember where exactly it is. There is a, um, a bit of loot to be had. I'll try and find it before I end the video, but I'm not going to lose my mind over it. But now these skill points are coming hot and heavy. Thank you for setting our camera. So we're going to come back the way we came from. Um, I just want to make sure. Yep. Yeah, okay. Come back the way we came from. That's not the way. We, that's the way we came from to come from. Ah, here we go. <laughs> oh, okay. So this is the beginning of the level. This is a circle. Remember these two guys, and I decided to go the other way. Ha! Ah, okay, so now you guys should understand how this map works. Okay. Yeah, it's like I say. This map is a bitch, especially if you take the um <laughs> especially if you take the shortcuts. <laughs> oh my god. And this is the beginning again, isn't it? I'm yes. Okay. Okay, I don't care anymore. I'm just gonna find the exit. This way. Definitely know I'm going the right way. Push this and there they are. So you now come across here, you open the blast doors. Bunker 2. I don't care about Bunker 2. I've already been to Bunker 2.
and that's since I ah there we go. Ah, so now we get to meet Jaime Reyes, and he is going to reward us, I believe, with our Augmentation Upgrade Canister. Oh man, I really hope that's what we get. Okay, so I'm going to stop here for now, I am going to do Paris proper in the next video. And I hope I'll see you guys there.